A Pioneer woman had to deal with several hardships. She basically took care of the entire camp and her family. She would wake up early, make the meals, keep everything organized when they broke camp and then when they set up each night, taking care of any children, their education, and keeping them in line. She was doing all of this while walking thousands of miles through all sorts of weather. Some common misconceptions with women on the trails are that they had an easy time or that they really didn't travel much at all. Pretty frequently people ask me if not a lot of women went or if they just got to ride in the wagon, when in reality they had to walk alongside of it with everyone else. One pioneer woman that always comes to mind for me is Mary Wells Yates. She was a woman that was widowed in her 40s and she decided, you know what, I'm gonna move the family from Missouri to Montana. She actually led over 10 wagon trains across the trails herself. I like to think of the West as a frontier for um, you know, expanding financially, expanding geographically, but also as a frontier for women's rights. For a lot of women, it was the first time to own land, the first time to own their own business, uh, so really it led the road for what we see now.